Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 5, and today we're going to be breaking down some new set photos that were released online via multiple sources, which I will credit in a minute, but if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. So, all credits go to Canada Graphs for multiple photos on here, and also credits go to YVR Shoots, and you guys can check out Canada Graphs' blog, and also their Twitter you guys should follow both of them to stay up to date with all your behind the scenes knowledge that you need to know in regards to photos and even on Canada Graphs' blog they actually outline some of the stuff that was actually shot so it gives you a bit more context. So finally the last thing that I want to say before we actually start this video is you guys should check out this flash versus reverse flash animation that was created by a YouTuber and a game creator known as Crimson Renz and it would mean a lot guys if you guys could go over there and show him some support and obviously say that you're from the DC TV show that I sent you as I think you you guys will really like the animation it's really great they overlay it with Grant Gustin and Matt Letcher actually talking and it's just brilliant I highly recommend it so go over there link in the description below but anyway let's get on to today's video so in the video we're going to be breaking down the set photos that were released and wow we got some really interesting ones so our first photo that comes from YVR shoots aka Hollywood North Buzz actually shows us our best look that we've had at Nora's new suit in the next season. It's a very, very nice photo, and wow, does this suit look good. It looks a whole lot better in this lighting. I was a fan of it when it was first released. I feel like this is a more authentic look at it because it's not at night time and you know, the lighting's not different. It's in the day and we get a really good look at her suit. And so you can really feel the colors as it actually pops through the screen as you can see in the photos. And I love her gauntlets on her arms. I love her gloves and I love the coloring on the boots. I think the whole colour scheme of this is what I personally really like. I'm not so sure about the symbol on her suit, I'm a massive fan of this. I love the details in the costume, it's much better than what Iris had. I think Iris's was such a prototype that it didn't really particularly work. And this is so upgraded with the gauntlets, the gloves and the boots and everything else that is more stitched together, more like a proper suit and it really works. So this is a great photo, all credits to YVR shoots for this. So moving on to some of the next photos and most of these photos all come from Canada Graphs and we get some shots of Grant on set as he was actually shooting at the same time but it was a bit later in the day and he was shooting with Jessica Parker Kennedy as Nora so they actually in the scenes they are working together and so the most interesting thing about these photos with Grant on the set is in fact that his suit is very different from what it is in the past. Obviously we've seen the new poster and we've seen the behind the scenes photo of his new suit. But as of right now, we actually haven't seen how he puts on his mask. And in this case, it looks like his suit goes up over his head, sort of like a hood, but it's very tight on his head. And then he takes the mask off and he puts it over a bit more like a helmet, which is really interesting. I don't think we'll get to see this on screen, but I think it's for practical use for Grant. And it's probably a bit easier than having to pull it all the way over his head from the back. So maybe this is just a practical use. Maybe we'll see it in the show. We'll have to wait and see. But those scenes you can see are with Nora and they are working together. And in Canada Graphs blog, they actually detail that when they were outside, there was a crowd of people all very well dressed. And they were all staring at the building in shock and horror. And Grant was there and Jessica was there. And they look up and then Grant goes off. And then Nora is left there. To watch the building so perhaps there's a fire perhaps something bad's happened to the building but i think most of that will obviously be done in post-production so we can't really tell as of now but we know that they're going to be working together even past episode one they're going to be working together quite a lot and it seems like there is a lot of trust if barry has actually left nora to do this to herself so i think the most interesting thing out of all these set photos is definitely the fact that grant's new suit is actually very different from the past and that it acts more like a helmet in regards to his cow. And so we can't particularly tell if his cow has actually changed as Grant teased, but we'll have to wait and see 
until we get to the episodes and also I love Nora's too it looks great in this brilliant photo from YVR shoots so anyway guys that is it for this video please be sure to check out that CW fan animation from Renz over on his channel that will be in the description below say that you're from me say that we sent you and that will be awesome because I think you guys will really enjoy that so anyway guys I'll see you guys later goodbye Shut free.